Yo what's up guys, in this tutorial we will learn how to make these really cool looking smoke circle burst animations in After Effects and yeah they are super simple and we just need one effect, one shape and yeah I'd say let's just go. So let's make a new composition and let's just add a background real quick but yeah. Okay so the most important thing is to add a shape layer and open this up go to add and add an ellipse path and yeah we will animate this one now so let's go to the beginning of our animation and yeah open this up and bring the size down to zero and just place a keyframe and then go forward to like one and a half seconds and just bring this up to whatever you like and yeah but now we can't see anything so we have to add a stroke as well so just go to add again and add a stroke and bring the size up to something like 50 maybe, yeah this looks good, maybe even bigger, 75, let's try this, and yeah this looks cool, but as we see this is really slow and doesn't look like an explosion at all, so let's change this real quick, so let's go to the size and click on it and also activate the graph editor with this setting, and click on the size again and make sure to press the easy ease button down here and let's just select the first keyframe and bring this up and yeah now this will start really fast and then slow down just like an explosion and yeah this is already really cool but of course it just stays and we don't want that so let's animate the stroke as well so let's go to the start again and place a keyframe just like how big we want it to be and then just go right before the end not exactly to the end but somewhere in here and just put this to zero and now we can see this looks really good but it doesn't look like smoke at all so we need one more crucial effect which is the rough and edges effect and yeah we can just apply this and as we can see it gets a bit more interesting and yeah now let's play with the settings so let's increase the border setting by a lot and as we can see this gets interesting but also kind of blurry and we don't want that so let's also increase so let's also increase the edge sharpness just until yeah it's not blurry again so in this case something like five and yeah this is cool but yeah let's also increase the scale a bit and now we can see yeah this looks really cool so just find a nice setting and yeah as this goes on it will just disappear into these small smoke particles and yeah that's already it thanks for watching of course you can just give it other colors or other settings in here if you want it to be more complex or whatever but i think this looks good and yeah thanks for watching see you next time